you are about to learn how to read data from a sequential file with Perl. This is the syntax of the open statement, which is key to being able to read from a file. The file handle is whatever you choose to call the file within your script. The less than symbol signifies that this file is to be used for input, and that's the default. The file name is the proper name of the file within your operating system's directory. When you read data from the file, you simply replace standard in with whatever file handle you're using. It is always a good idea to close your file as soon as you're finished with it. This is the Perl script that I wrote to process the file personnel. We created that in our last episode. And in this highlighted line, I'm opening the file personnel for input and associating it with the file handle employees. Then I come down and I do my priming read. I'm saying that the scalar variable record is equal to employees. Notice that it's an input just like standard in, but instead of standard in, I'm using employees. Then I come down to a while loop and I'm going to continue processing my file until I reach an end of file condition. What I'm doing is very simple. The first thing is printing out the contents of record and concatenating a couple of carriage returns for double spacing. Then I read another one. And I'll do that until again I reach end of file, in which case I'll terminate access by closing employees. Okay, let's cat personnel so we can see the data that's actually there. We've got Winnegar, comma Mark, comma CEO, Cavalier, comma Grace, comma admin assistant, and our third and final record is Sorensen, comma Bonnie, comma artistic director. Our program is called read file with a capital F. Now this file is very simple. All it does is read a record from our input file and print it out. And it does that until it runs out of data. So here we go. There's our data. Our output is reading data from a file, which is the title that I gave it. And then each of our records, Winnegar, Cavalier, Sorensen, and it's done. You now know how to write a Perl script to read data from a file and produce a listing. Next time we'll learn how to append to a data file.